Jax had always been a skilled chef, renowned for his ability to create unique and exquisite desserts, but his obsession with creating the perfect dessert had always been both his biggest strength and his biggest weakness. It was a dreary and rainy day in the city when Jax first had the idea for his new dessert creation. He was sitting in his cozy kitchen, sipping on a hot cup of coffee and staring out the window at the raindrops pelting against the glass. He knew that he would need something special to brighten up the mood of the city, something that would transport people away from their troubles into the world of decadent indulgence. That's when he thought of a swell chocolate bar, with a hypnotic swirl of caramel and peanuts around a rich chocolate core. Jax had always been intrigued by the unique and hypnotic design, and he knew that he could take it to the next level with his culinary expertise. For weeks, he tirelessly experimented with different ingredients, trying to find the perfect combination of flavours and textures. He tried everything, from exotic fruits to rare spices, but nothing quite hit the mark. It wasn't until he stumbled upon a rare hallucinogenic plant extract that he knew he had found the missing piece. He had acquired it from the shady dealer in the dark corners of the city, and he knew it was risky to use it in the desserts, but he couldn't resist the temptation to create something truly unique. He just added a small dose of the extract to his decadent chocolate cake, layering it with smooth caramel and crunchy peanuts to create a truly hypnotic experience. When he first took the bite, he knew he had created something special. The first few people who had tried the dessert were blown away by its flavour and beauty, and the word quickly spread throughout the city. People came from far and wide just to taste Jack's creation, and his business flourished like never before. But then, things started to get strange. People who had eaten dessert began experiencing bizarre and frightening hallucinations, with some becoming more aggressive and others seeming almost possessed. Jax was horrified, and he knew he had to get to the bottom of what was happening. He contacted Mrs. Smith, the wealthy businessman, who had ordered the special dessert, and Mrs. Smith revealed that the truth about the swirl chocolate bars, they were part of an experimental batch that had been tampered by a group of rogue scientists who had infused them with a potent, mind-altering substance. Jax was devastated. He had unwittingly contributed to the spread of the dangerous candy, and he vowed to do everything in his power to stop it. With the help of Mrs. Smith and a few other concerned citizens, Jack set out to track down the source of the tainted chocolate bars and put an end up to the rogue scientist's plan. Their journey was perilous and filled with danger, with Jack and his companions facing many challenges along the way. They encountered corrupt officials, dangerous criminals, and other obstacles that threatened to stop them at every turn, but they never gave up. Give, driven by their determination to put an end to the mind control, candy and all for all, they battled their way through the dark and seedy underbelly of the city, risking their lives in the sanity to stop the evil forces that threatened to destroy the city. In the end, they succeeded. The rogue scientists were brought to justice and the Italian chocolate bars were destroyed. Jax was hailed as a hero, both for his amazing dessert and for his bravery in taking on the dark and dangerous forces that threatened to destroy the city. But Jax never forgot the danger of a secret ingredient, and he vowed to never let his obsession with creating the perfect dessert lead him down a dangerous path again. Instead, he continued to create beautiful and indulgent desserts.